There's something very elemental about bread. It's just flour, water, salt, and it's something that's been a cornerstone of so many cultures across the world for a long time. People always ask, like, how did, you know, Tartine get so popular? And there's lots of reasons. You know, we care about what we do. We're very deliberate about how we make things and why, and sourcing and sustainability. But one of the easiest and overlooked things that we did is just made really fresh stuff. Every Tartine has windows in the kitchen. You see everyone working. And we're literally handing you a loaf hot from the oven and putting it in your hands. One of the cool things about baking to me is that it's very left brain and right brain. It really helps to know, like, what the temperature is and how much hydration you have going into the dough. But at the same time, it really comes down to almost this empathy you have with the dough. Like, what does it need at this moment? It's the reason I love it so much. Sustainability and agriculture is at the forefront of everything that we do. And when I think of that, I just think how much we care about our product being fresh because it speaks to how we care for our farmers. Everything that they do matters to them, therefore it matters to us. The past few years, we really decided to look back at our supply chain and the very sort of elemental basic thing of what we do, which is partnering with farmers and millers to get the best product for us, but also just to develop these relationships to take sustainability to a deeper level. We're working with a lot of grains that haven't been widely available to bakers for the last 50 to 100 years, which is pretty awesome. And we're working on a new book with some of these recipes that we've developed out of the flours that we're getting to use now. That is sort of tricky because Chad and I are bouncing around a lot these days. So we have like a big drop box pot where we'll throw some recipes in and it's a good way for us to have a central source of sharing things back and forth. Communication is the key to success and the key to failure in so many aspects of how we work. The assumption is that if you do something at a very high level, there's no way to scale it without compromising the quality. The more people said that to me, the more I really thought of it as more of a challenge because utilizing technology and good training and building good teams, there should be a way to empower that artisanal process without compromise. I think that what we do at Tartine is a pretty good template. And if you can copy that template and make another small bakery here and another small bakery there, then you're touching more communities and getting more good bread to more people.